What's up, guys? It's Yujin Tang. Um, I'm the host of Super Simple Python. Today, we're going to be building an AI content moderator in a few parts. We're going to have a web scraper, a content moderator, and an orchestrator. Um, this is not an episode of Super Simple Python. This is not something you can do in 15 minutes. Um, but basically, what we're going to do here is we're going to create a content moderation system that goes to a website, any website, and it scrapes all the text from the website, and then it returns a rating for the website. Um, whether that website is safe for, uh, you know, teens or uh, is uh, NSFW. So basically what we're going to do here is we're just going to start by creating a web scraper. And all I'm going to do here really is I'm just going to follow the tutorial that, that I wrote on how to create a web scraper recently. Um, and so from here we're going to import selenium dot, uh, oops, import selenium, sorry, huh. from selenium we're going to import a web driver. import web driver there we go um, and then we're going to import the Chrome service from selenium dot web driver dot Chrome dot service um, import service and then from selenium dot web driver dot Chrome dot options we're going to import options excuse me and then we're going to import beautiful soup Beautiful soup. Um, and oh yeah, you have to install Selenium and Beautiful Soup before you uh, use them, obviously. And you also need Chrome Driver, and I'll put the link for Chrome Driver in the uh, in the in the description below. Um, so we'll do Chrome Driver path, Chrome Driver path, Chrome Driver path equals. And because I'm on a Windows computer, I need to escape these backslashes. Okay. Um, and then from here, we're just going to create the service. Service equals service with the Chrome driver path. And then uh, options equals options. And I'm going to run this in headless mode. So what I'm going to do here is options.add argument. Headless. Headless mode means we're not going to see the actual um, Chrome browser like pop up. So let's find our function. So we'll do, uh, you know, scrape, scrape page text. Uh, and we'll just take a URL. Uh, and we'll expect that URL to be a string. So the first thing we're going to want to do is we're going to want to create our driver. So driver, um, all we'll do here is we'll just do driver dot web driver web drive. Oh, whoops, no, no, uh, wait, 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 Chrome web driver. Yeah, web driver dot Chrome uh, service. Just no service. Yep, no, so just just regular service. Yep, okay. And then, uh, well, actually, we'll do service equals service options equals options. Okay, uh, and then we want to launch our driver. Oh, for we're gonna have to build in some time. So uh, import time. No, from time import sleep because we just wanted to sleep from time import sleep. Okay. Now I'll do driver dot get URL, and we'll let it sleep for a bit. Um, you know, let's just say sleep three seconds. This is so that it has like time to like load the URL and stuff. Um, and then we'll just use Selenium to get the soup. So soup equals beautiful soup, uh, driver dot page source, HTML dot parser, parser. Oh, uh, and then we'll just scrape all the text from this page. So text equals soup dot get text. And we'll probably clean it up a little bit. Uh, let's get rid of like the new line, so text equals text dot replace um, slash n with just nothing. Uh, so let's just add like a random. Um, I'll just you know what? Here's the URL that we'll just use. We'll just use the web scraper tutorial that I built earlier. And then let's oh let's return the text.
Um, yeah. Uh, print. We'll just take a look at what this looks like, right? Scrape page text URL. Python web scraper. Cool. Uh, so you see that some of it is like the, uh, what is it called? Boilerplate text. Um, but that's okay because, <clears throat> <clears throat> oh, it's also, ooh, also scrape the code, huh? Uh, basically what we want to do is we just want to get all the text on the page and we're just going to return that. And, um, cause you know, I mean, if there's even, I mean, if there's text in the, on like the ads or if there's text in the boilerplate, that's you know, not safe, then, you know, we want to include that because that's, that's part of the page. So that's part of the content moderation. So this is part one, just creating the web scraper to get all the text. And then part two, we're going to go and we're going to create our content moderator. Okay. Uh, so I forgot to put this in the last web scraper one. This is like part two of part one, but basically you're going to want to have a driver quit here. And I, I put this in part three and, but you don't have one driver quit here because you don't want to have like a ton of drivers open when you like a ton of Chrome tabs open basically. Um, so that's what you need to do before you finish the web scraper. Um, and once again, you know, if you like this, if this was helpful for you, please like, please subscribe, please share with your friends and uh, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.